So we are now at the eastern end, eastern end of the culvert, and we are approaching the ooh, rope, the debris screen. Now here is quite interesting because because apparently this is where dog killing broke. So, yay. Okay. <laughs> Definitely place to place your feet because this is not this is not a stable bottom. Now that little thing right there, that is a ma that was a massive clue in Solomon Dog Hill Brook. As I think that might be the old Alexandra Park sewer. Now we can confirm it. Also, what the fuck is this metal contraption right here? I must have a while actually to climb to make it in one of these videos. God knows what that is. Here, this was all for nothing. Oh wait, never mind. Oh crap! What door? Okay, so now. What? through that mess. So into the call up we go. that. See that? The toilet splits into two. Yeah, they both lead to the same place, and I was fine. And I have no idea which tunnel to take. Well, 
purposes of this, I'm taking the left hand culvert. Thanks for recording. One thing to remember is the fact that rumbling you hear is that in the sound of Mulderus Road, it's the road above us. What the hell? Is that a penstock I see? No, it's clearly not a penstock. It's some kind of giant pipe running across the culvert. Serious info. Not wrenching me up that because I'm not willing to. Wow, that mud is deep. This is gonna be slow. My goodness, that's Red Lion Brook. Wow, that is certainly not what I expected. So, there is the other side of that. I will talk about Red Lion Brook in a future video. Anyway. My fucking god. The mud in there is very deep. It is very deep and very gassy. I'm honestly happy it just did not overtop my waders. Jeez. Thanks for warning me. Drain Maestro. Oh, uh, yeah. The other one. Hmm. Can we venture up this thing? Yeah, sure, why not? Now we know where it ends, so we should be fine. Also, this is almost certainly the, the smell I, I smelt last time I was here. It, it, it legitimately smells like spray paint here. It's so weird. I mean... Okay. That's a bit odd. Oh boy. 
Yeah, it's a bit strange. Why, why are these bolting into the wall? Anyway, yeah, the reason why I'm going up here is because I want to see if I can if I can locate Dog Kennel Brook. You know, the mystery, the mystery stream that I that has been bothering me for months now. Oh yeah, I can see the other end. Nice. Oh fish! Fishy fishies! Hey fishies! Who knew there were fish in the Gore Brook? Thought this place would be dead of life considering how polluted it is. Hi fishies! There's tons of fish in here. Little fishies. And this place is a little more for fish. It's probably a little it's probably safe. Not a short call, but so unlike so gas build up unlikely. <sighs> Still just know what that damn metal pipe is. I'll probably speed this footage up so you don't have to so you don't have to watch the same shit again. Egg. What a strange thing to discover. Some fish expert can identify what kind of fish those are. I'm very happy. Because what kind of fish lives in this... in this absolute stinking hellhole of a tunnel? Like, ugh. I think a slight tight end that tunnel. Fears to be flowing. There's a non-zero chance that, that could actually be Dog Kennel Brook. So, we now need to start looking at some historical maps. So, this is the... 1840s map and you can see Dog Kennel Brook running running open for basically all of its length there is no issues because there is it hasn't even been touched by culverts yet So this is the so this is the 1888 to 1915 map, and I believe this is the last map app that could potentially have any any of of Dog Kennel Brook still running open on them on them. So yeah, even as 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 early as the 1890s, his dog kennel brook was completely reculverted and was a lost river. So in modern times, dog kennel brook brook's source is now is buried somewhere under. Whereby Walmer Street East in Rushome. 
So, it then runs down Walnut Street, through some houses, then, then follows Claremont Road. Road for, for passing under Alexander Park. Okay, it is worth noting that the lake in Alexander Park is was most likely filled using Dog Kennel Brook, which is sited in the Lost Rivers of Manchester. Dog Kennel Brook also has an overflow pipe which feeds into Longford Brook. Or it finally ends somewhere down in that tunnel. Somewhere down here. On K plus any what one on that says. Okay. I think it's a fake egg and not a real egg, so, yeah. Well, oh, guys, what should we say? This this rock might start Chilton Brook. I think so. You might, you may or may not recognise this thing from my short seven months ago. Right, knocked, right, knocked into the river. Play that clip. Oh, damn, it was you. 